Imagine living in a time when China was the most prosperous and culturally diverse nation on earth. Welcome to the Tang Dynasty. This remarkable era spanning from 618 to 907 AD stands as a beacon in Chinese history, a period of unprecedented growth and influence. The Tang Dynasty, renowned for its vibrant cosmopolitan culture, is often hailed as a golden age of high Chinese civilization. It's a time when art, literature, and ideas flourished, and China's influence extended across vast tracts of Asia. This was not merely a Chinese empire, but a global one, with its reach felt from the steppes of Mongolia to the heart of the Middle East. Its legacy is woven into the very fabric of modern China and the wider world. Now let's take a step back in time and explore the fascinating world of the Tang Dynasty. The story of the Tang Dynasty begins with a rebellion. In the early 7th century, the Sui Dynasty was in power, but its rule was marked by harsh laws, heavy taxes, and forced labor. The people were discontent and rebellions were brewing. Amid this turmoil, one man saw an opportunity. His name was Li Yuan, a high-ranking official and a member of the royal family. Li Yuan was a man of ambition and cunning. He knew the Sui Dynasty was on its last legs and he saw the opportunity to take power for himself. His chance came in the year 617. The emperor of the Sui dynasty Yang Di was murdered by his own officials. Seizing the moment, Li Yuan led a successful rebellion against the remaining Sui forces. In the year 618, Li Yuan declared himself the emperor of a new dynasty, the Tang dynasty. He took the name Emperor Gaozu, meaning high ancestor. He moved the capital to Chang'an, now known as Xi'an, which became the political, economic, and cultural center of China. However, the road to power was not an easy one. Establishing a new dynasty was a monumental task. There were rival factions to deal with as well as the remnants of the Sui dynasty. But Li Yuan, with his military prowess and political acumen, managed to consolidate his power. He implemented policies that eased the burden on the common people, won their support, and stabilized the country. One of the most significant events during the early years of the Tang Dynasty was the implementation of the Equal Field System, a land distribution policy that aimed to prevent the concentration of land in the hands of the wealthy. This policy played a crucial role in stabilizing the economy and ensuring the prosperity of the Tang Dynasty. So, with the establishment of the Tang Dynasty, a new era began in China. This era was marked by great advancements in art, culture, and technology, creating a legacy that would influence China and the world for centuries to come. The Tang Dynasty is often referred to as China's Golden Age, but why is that? Let's dive into the heart of the matter. The Tang Dynasty spanning the 7th to 10th centuries was a period of unparalleled growth and prosperity. It was a time when China's influence reached far and wide, creating a melting pot of diverse cultures and ideas. From the Middle East to Korea, people flocked to the Tang capital, Chang'an, bringing with them a wealth of knowledge, traditions, and beliefs. This cultural fusion gave rise to a society that thrived on innovation, creativity, and intellectual discourse. But the Golden Age wasn't just about cultural diversity. It was also a time of extraordinary economic growth. The Tang rulers implemented economic policies that spurred trade and commerce. The Silk Road, a network of trade routes connecting China to the West, flourished under Tang rule, turning China into a global economic powerhouse. The bustling markets of Chang'an were filled with exotic goods from far-off lands, testifying to the prosperity of the era. Technological advancements were another hallmark of the Tang Dynasty's Golden Age. One of the most significant inventions of this period was woodblock printing. This ingenious method of printing text, images, or patterns onto paper or fabric revolutionized communication and education. It made books more widely available, promoting literacy and learning among the masses. The Golden Age also witnessed significant advancements in medicine, astronomy, and engineering. Tang physicians developed new treatments and surgical techniques, while astronomers made accurate celestial observations that contributed to the creation of the world's first printed star atlas. Engineers, on the other hand, built grand palaces, bridges, and canals, showcasing the technical prowess of the era. From cultural diversity to economic prosperity and technological advancements, the Tang Dynasty was a time of tremendous growth and progress. It was an era marked by grandeur and innovation, a time when China stood at the forefront of civilization. 
It's clear to see why the Tang Dynasty is often referred to as a Golden Age. All good things must come to an end and the Tang Dynasty was no exception. It's often said that the seeds of downfall are sown in times of prosperity. This was certainly true for the Tang Dynasty. After the Golden Age, corruption began to creep into the political system. Officials who were once paragons of virtue began to succumb to the allure of wealth and power. Bribery and embezzlement became rampant, eroding the foundations of the once robust Tang administration. But political corruption was just the tip of the iceberg. The Tang Dynasty was also hit by a series of natural disasters. Droughts, floods and famines ravaged the land, decimating crops and causing widespread starvation. The once flourishing economy stumbled and the government's inability to provide relief further eroded public trust. Amidst this turmoil, a catastrophic event took place, the Anlushan Rebellion. Anlushan, a disgruntled general, led a massive military revolt against the Tang. The rebellion raged on for eight long years, draining the empire's resources and causing staggering loss of life. Although the rebellion was eventually quelled, the dynasty was left weakened, its glory tarnished beyond repair. The final blow came from the eunuchs who had gained substantial power within the court. They manipulated emperors, controlled state affairs, and even assassinated those who posed a threat to their power. The once mighty Tang dynasty was now a puppet in the hands of these eunuchs. Public discontent grew and revolts sprang up across the empire. The Tang rulers, bereft of public support and military strength, were unable to quell these uprisings. In the year 907, the last Tang emperor was forced to abdicate, marking the end of the Tang dynasty. And so, the Tang dynasty, once a beacon of prosperity and cultural diversity, came to an end. But as we'll see in our next segment, the legacy of the Tang dynasty lived on, influencing generations to come. Stay tuned for that and don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more intriguing historical insights. The Tang dynasty may have fallen, but its legacy lives on. This extraordinary period in Chinese history witnessed the flourishing of literature, art, fashion, and governance, leaving an indelible imprint on the world. The Tang Dynasty was a veritable renaissance of Chinese literature. The period saw the emergence of many legendary poets such as Li Bai and Du Fu, whose works still resonate today. The Tang also birthed a unique form of poetry, Thai Shi, which continues to inspire and influence contemporary Chinese poets. Beyond literature, the Tang Dynasty set the stage for significant advancements in art. The period was renowned for its painting and sculpture, particularly Buddhist art. The aesthetic principles of the Tang, including the emphasis on harmony, proportion and balance, continue to shape Chinese art and aesthetics. Fashion, too, was revolutionized during the Tang era. The dynasty was known for its flamboyant and colorful clothing styles, a stark contrast to the austere fashions of preceding dynasties. The Tang's influence on fashion extended across borders, influencing clothing styles in neighboring Korea and Japan, and echoes of these styles can still be seen in traditional East Asian attire today. In the realm of governance, the Tang Dynasty established a model of administration that has had a profound impact on the structure of modern China. The dynasty implemented a system of merit-based examinations for selecting government officials, a practice that has been adapted and is still in use in China's civil service system. The Tang Dynasty was also instrumental in promoting cultural exchange. Its cosmopolitan capital, Chang'an, was a melting pot of different cultures, fostering an atmosphere of tolerance and diversity. This spirit of inclusivity and exchange is a cornerstone of China's modern global outlook. The Tang Dynasty's influence can still be seen today, a testament to its enduring legacy. This period of Chinese history, though long past, continues to shape and inspire, its echoes resonating in the culture, art, literature, governance, and spirit of modern China and beyond. The Tang Dynasty was a time of prosperity, cultural diversity, and innovation. A period that, in many ways, shaped the course of China's history and continues to reverberate through the ages. We began our journey with the founding of the Tang Dynasty, a period of unification under the powerful Li family. We saw how they brought together disparate territories, setting the stage for an era of unrivaled prosperity and cultural advancement. The Golden Age, a time of unparalleled progress and innovation, was a testament to the Tang Dynasty's greatness. 
From the flourishing of arts and literature to the advancement of trade along the Silk Road, the Tang Dynasty was a beacon of enlightenment in a world looking for direction. It was a period when China led the world in science, technology, and culture. But as with all great empires, the Tang Dynasty had its twilight. The fall of the Tang Dynasty was a period marked by internal strife, rebellion, and eventual decline. Yet even in its downfall, the Tang Dynasty left an indelible mark on the pages of history. The legacy of the Tang Dynasty is as profound as it is enduring. Its influence on Chinese culture, law, politics, and society is undeniable. The Tang Dynasty's contributions to art, literature, science, and technology continue to shape our world today. It was a time when China was the world's most advanced civilization, a beacon for others to follow. In the annals of history, the Tang Dynasty stands as a symbol of China's vibrant past. It is a testament to the resilience and ingenuity of the Chinese people, a testament to their ability to rise, to shine, and to leave a lasting legacy. Thank you for joining us on this journey through time. We hope you've found it as fascinating as we have. Don't forget to subscribe for more fascinating insights into history.